Okay, you know, I, I thought Duke Paul showed a lot of heart and a lot of courage and really why they're a really good team and a great program. Third game in five days and then had to fly in this morning to play and you would never have noticed that at all in the way they were determined to play and win. Obviously their freshman center um, was tremendous again and it just shows it's a mindset a lot of times as opposed to fatigue, it's a mindset. And their mindset right now is one of a champion, one that wants to play really well. I mean, they came off a game against UConn on Wednesday. That was a great game. They came a game against St. John's on Friday. That was a great game. They flew in this morning because of weather. And they, and they, you know, really turned it on the second half. So, you know, I give them a lot of credit. Well, I, I think early in the game we did a good job of getting her the ball and she was very active. Um, I think as the game went on, we, we didn't see her as much as we should have, and that was disappointing in itself. But Sydney has a lot of talent. I'm proud of her. She was very frustrated after our last game, and, and, and I told her what I needed her out of her and expected her. And she's a well-raised, smart, team-oriented player, and instead of being upset, she was upset with herself and really, as you could see, had a couple good days of practice and played really well today. And I'm hoping she can build on that. And as a team and program, we can get her the ball better and uh, we can continue to develop. You know, for a while it was good. I mean, we only lost by five and they were one of the best rebound teams in the country. Um, I thought we, we really battled for a long period of time. You know, not having a couple people, even though they were dressed, being able to play. Some of our big kids, that hurt us a little bit. But these girls battled, and, and I was happy with that. Yeah, Andre really struggled. I, 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 you know, I would think probably that's a good question for her and ask her why she struggled. Um, I'm not sure. You know, I, I thought she would come out and play a really good game um, against this team, but she struggled, definitely. Oh, Maya, Maya's day-to-day -day with an injury. So she's one of, and we had two other kids dressed that are injured, but we had them dressed just in case. So we're still hurting, and you know, I, I think a big part of the team's successes that are good, Creighton and DePaul, they've had the same starting lineup every game. It's the 23rd game in a row that pulls out the same starting lineup, and it shows their consistency. Um, we've got to find a way to be able to do that more. But, you know, I felt bad for Maya. She was very upset she couldn't play. She tried, but she just couldn't go. I don't think there's an easy part of our schedule, especially in the Big East with such good teams. I realize their records are not as good as the teams we've just played, but those teams haven't played together and haven't been injury free and haven't had a chance to play some of the other teams that they could be successful against. Um, so they're going to be tremendous battles for us. I mean, Georgetown's always played us hard. They're big, strong, physical, won another game today um, without a couple of their kids. So that's going to be hard. And right now we're not in a good frame of mind. We're really struggling um, as a team. So right now, we, we, we have to worry about ourselves because right now we're, 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 we got to just go back to the drawing board and try and understand why we're struggling as much as we are. Yeah, I, I think Amari was, you know, obviously, you know, practiced a lot better, was maybe a little nervous at the beginning, but I thought gave us some really good minutes. And I think Amari's a very good guard. She's got to get more consistent and more confident in herself. And hopefully today we helped her with that confidence. I think they, they imposed their will. We missed a couple of easy shots, and I think we lost a lot of our pep and our, in, and, and, and our energy on both ends of the court. We started to stand around. We reverted back to playing offense the way we had in the previous two games as opposed to in the first game. Even though Sydney had a lot of points, we were still moving the ball, and I thought those things were really effective.